Hello guys, in this new tutorial of .NET MAUI, today we're going to try to open a PDF file inside our own read application. If you are new in this video, so you need to see the old videos of this series. Before that, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for more videos. Great, let's begin by creating a new uh, folder called interfaces in which we're going to define a new interface called iFiles service. Let's add the namespace here. So here I'm using Visual Code, so you need to add the namespace or installing um, C Sharp Dev Kit extension. So let's define the interface here in which we're going to add a new signature of a method called save and view so it will be task save and view and this method takes four parameters the file name the the file will be stream here memory stream the opening mode and the content type so by default it will be application slash PDF. Now let's go and define the open option. It will be enumeration. So let's begin by adding a new folder called domain in which we're gonna, for example, define the models, enumeration, etc. So here let's add another folder called enums in which we're gonna add a new enumeration called open option adding the namespace here and pdf.domain.enums and we're going to add public enum open option the first one will be in app the second one will be choose app great let's move here to the file service and let's import the using great now let's go under android folder and creating a new one called services in which we're gonna define the logic of save and view let's delete all this and implement I file service interface adding the method here and we need to define the logic of save and view so this um, method will be an asynchronous uh, method so first of all let's begin by adding two variables the first one will be the exception equal to string.empty and the root equal to no so here the the root equal to environment get folder path here we're gonna get the my document from the system uh, path after that we need to make sure that we have a folder inside my documents to save my files so here we're gonna create a new path combined between uh, the root path and the open pdf folder and here let's create the folder by making my dear dot mkdir after that we're gonna try to create an empty file after that we're gonna check if the file exists already we need to delete it great let's add a try catch here block in which we're gonna try to copy the stream inside the created file so here we're gonna make output stream dot write the stream dot ray add stream dot flash and we close the stream let's declare an exception here if there is any exception we need to throw it inside the exception variable great let's check now if the file dot exists and the content type different from html for security reasons so let's make first of all we need to uh, calculate the extension here 
So the MIP time type map dot get file extension folder from URL and we need to define the static using here um on dried net equal to on dried dot net and if you're gonna use it you read dot from file and we give the file name here to string great after that we need to define the map type it will be equal to singleton dot get my time from extension after that we need to create a new intent here in order to open the pdf in this intent so the variable intent equal to new intent of action view after that we need to set some flags here so the activity flags clear top and the new task after that we need to add a path here will be equal to on right x dot card dot content dot file provider dot get file get URI for file and here we need to define another using called android app and using the context and getting the package name plus so let's use the interpolation here to make the concatenation and the file great now let's define the set data to yeah set data and type which takes the path and the name type Great, now we need to add the grant read URI permission and switch the context. Let's see, case of open option in app. So we need to um, open the, the, the PDF directly in any application can read pdf file or the second option is to show for the user a pop-up to choose an application to open um, the pdf nice now let's move to the main page here and inject we're gonna instantiate the file service here manually but in real case you need to inject this service through uh, the IUC. Now we're going to use this click method. So we need a HTTP client to read, for example, any PDF from internet. And here we're going to make um, file service dot save and view. Let's give a name PDF file dot PDF. And before that, we need a stream here. So let's create a stream variable equal to new memory stream in which we're going to make content dot content dot read byte array async. Great. Let's add the weight here. That's great. And before running the application, we need to add some configuration here for Android uh, application. So we need to add under resources an XML um, folder in which we're going to define the provider path here so we can copy it from the github source and in the Android manifest here we need to open it and we need to declare the, the provider here so just copy these two lines inside and don't forget to add the permission here to read the file from the storage. Great, let's run the application and see. Let's click on the button here. And normally, yes, here we have our PDF file. Great, so that's all for today.
thank you for watching and see you in the next tutorial how to open the pdf for ios application thank you